Sometimes we are praying for an open heaven. But what we need today is a revelation that heaven is always open. What do I mean by an open heaven? I am talking about accessing what is always available in God, through God, and by God. There's a beautiful scripture in Ephesians 3 verse 12, and in the Passion Translation it says, We have boldness through Jesus, and free access, free access as kings before the Father. Not as paupers, not as slaves, but as kings. We have free access as kings before the Father because of our complete confidence in Christ's faithfulness. Right now, church is looking different. Today, God wants us to know that a different environment doesn't restrict an open heaven. It might seem easier to enter the presence of God when you're in a worship service at your church, but open heaven is available right here, right now, today, wherever you might be. You might be in your bedroom, you might be in your lounge room, you might be at home, but open heaven is just as available. But here's the thing we need to really understand. Sometimes we get to just step in. We just get to step in at church. But at home, sometimes we need to push through. We need to push through to engage. God says, if you draw near to me, I will draw near to you. And this is an invitation. Sometimes we just step in. Sometimes we push through. God gave me an an analogy of going to Kmart. You go 9.30 at night on a weeknight. You can, it's just so easy. There's almost no one there. You can walk straight in, get what you want and walk out. But then you have a picture of the Boxing Day sales and it is chaos. It takes a lot more effort. You have to push through to take hold of what's just as available at a weeknight when it's not Boxing Day. God wants us to know that what's available to you when you go to church is just as available to you when you're at home. But you might not feel it. You might have distractions around about. So here's God's encouragement this weekend for your local church. As you watch at home online, will you just be a spectator and feel this is different, I'm not getting anything from it? Or will you press in? Will you lean in? Will you enter in and access what's just as available as if you were in that building? Remember, the building is not sacred. The building is not the temple. You're the temple. You're the dwelling place of God. And there is an open invitation this weekend. I encourage you to engage with your church online and to press in and experience an open heaven. It might not be as easy, but it is just as available. I declare that this is a day of encounter for every Christian. And today, as you go to church this weekend, I pray you encounter the presence of God because you have pushed through to take hold of what is available. God bless you.